A Boy Scout project unlike any other, why this 16-year-old is spreading his, spending his spare time cleaning up a long-forgotten cemetery. In Maynor, a long-forgotten cemetery is getting some much-needed attention. You'll meet the young man behind an effort to clean it up and have it designated a historical site. Those buried at the old Rector Cemetery in Maynor date back to the time of the town's founder, James B. Maynor. As KVU's Andrew Horansky reports, now a high school student is working to keep their memory alive. Deep in the heart of the Shadow Glen Golf Club, a small stand of trees seems almost out of place. But take a closer look. Um, you want to just go inside over here first? This is 16-year-old Zach Givens, a Boy Scout and sophomore at Pflugerville High School. And this is the old Rector Cemetery, covered in growth. The oldest headstone dates back to the mid-1800s and belongs to the first wife of James B. Maynor, the town's founder. These stones are believed to mark the grave of a former slave. The plot was nearly forgotten up until the land was cleared for the course. A few years ago, the golf club put up this outer fence to protect the cemetery, but little was done to actually preserve it. People simply don't visit anymore. The hope is that by bringing it back to life, people will come back. And that's where Givens comes in. Over the next few weeks, he is hoping to raise $400 and find volunteers who are willing to start cleaning. As you can see, some of the headstones have fallen over, and they're starting to collect uh, mold and just kind of get aged. And what I'm trying to do is bring out the original beauty of the cemetery. After that, he will make an appeal to the state for a marker that would designate this as a historical site. And hopefully, if I can make this a nicer-looking cemetery and bring it back, um, it'll help with the history. A history that must not be forgotten in a quiet corner of Travis County where nearly two dozen graves are at rest. Andrew Horansky, KVU News.